Well, as you can see, I got a little, little uh, tropical shirt on. I don't know if you want to call it Hawaiian shirt. I don't know. But basically, as you guys can see from the title, we are going down to Florida. And it is the day before we're leaving. We're leaving at 7 a.m. tomorrow. My grandparents are coming over, uh, Pops and Memes. And we are going to have a little fish fry beforehand before we get too rowdy. And we're going to be heading down to Florida. Um, it's going to be a, a nice little road trip. I think we're going to make a halfway stop and um, stop. Uh, camp halfway and then go to the rest halfway but yeah stay tuned um see you guys tomorrow morning I'm getting packed right now and this should be a fun trip folks we're on the road there's Papa what's up driving the old uh what do you what is this called pops Betty White Betty White driving the old Betty White we got the dogs out there going to the bathroom because they were whining and we are right now in the old Illinois so it's the same old, same old. Boring. Wide open. We're at a gas station. See y'all in the next state. We're at our next stop. I was gonna bring my winter coat, but I'm like, no, we're going. It's gonna be warm. That's what I'm saying. Further south. Lunch break. Don't hide break. And it's pop a break. What's up? Kentucky, right, Ma? Right. Gotcha. We're still in, like, we're in the middle of the tail of Kentucky. Deb, how, what do you think about your uh, dinner there, buddy? It's mood. Why? Not enough steak in it. There's like oh, six God. pieces of steak. Yeah, I got jipped on the chicken. I just add extra. Meat. Everybody's just not grateful around here, I guess. I mean, I got I my Taco Bell. Yeah, so I mean, it's gonna do you good. What do you think, Mimi? How's yours? Mine was good, but mine's always good. There, there we go. We're on a Mexican pizza. What about your chalupa? You know, my chalupa was phenomenal. Mom, how's your uh, mess of diarrhea? <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> That's good. And Ellie got the same old, same old that she's been having the past five years. So we are going to be heading to our five star hotel in the bottom of Nashville. So we will uh, see you guys when we get there. Maybe get some cool shots of Nashville at night. And I don't know. Stay tuned, I guess. All right, Pops and I are right here. What do you think, buddy? Um, we're in somewhere near Nashville at a rest area is where we're going to spend the night. This is our five-star hotel. So we got 15 beds in our little hotel room. And for tomorrow morning, for the bed and breakfast, we got the old vending machines up there in their little store. <laughs> so. And your mom made muffins. That too. That's just the side that's though. Wrong. Oh yeah, that's right. We are not poor enough to get the deluxe. We'll see you guys tomorrow morning once we wake up. We're on the other side of the border of Tennessee and Kansas, so see you guys later.
stuff like that. A lot of cool things like trash on the road. So, stay tuned. All right, well, Pops and I just took out the dogs because uh, they're getting rowdy. <laughs> Still and I just said it too. He says, play with me. So there's that. Really? Well, they're getting Subway, so that's gonna be our lunch, and then we're gonna get out of here. It's a really scary place over here. Let me show you. I swear I seen like some homeless guy over there or something like that running around. There's like trash all around here. And we're in the back of some abandoned building. There's probably hobos in there. Slender Man might be there too, but who knows? So. Is this what we're gonna do now? Huh? Well, just stay tuned. Sooner or later we'll be in Florida. We got like four hours. Hold on, let me check. Hey, what's wrong with you? Destination time 6.30 and it is about two. So we have about three, four hours. So stay tuned folks. Getting excited. Today we got like two more hours left until we hit our campground. And here we go. Let's show you the uh, old GPS type thing or something. We got somebody tailing behind us. No gators yet. No uh, pine squirrels or polar bears. So I'll let you know if we see anything crazy. Holy cow, that was a quick shower. Oh, what? Fly. Well, it's a really uh, windy one. Not really. It's it's pretty windy. That's what we got going on here. Ma's sitting in the chair. I was sitting there. I'll be sitting back there in a little bit. Pops is chilling out here. Loving life. Mimi. Loving life, reading books, Devlin. Over here. So we're out here to watch the sunset. I'm also gonna be uh, casting around and stuff. There's the wind. So stay tuned, maybe get some cool shots of the sunset, who knows. And I will be going out fishing. So we got a lot, we got a lot of places to cover, let me show you that. All of that. And we got the sunrise right there. All right, I'm gonna get the GoPro on. Let's get the action. Yeah. Oh, what a cast! That went further than I thought. Good. <laughs> Pop, are you happy about that? I don't know. But someone's gonna have to sit in that chair, though, right? Oh man, here we go. Using the old walleye rod. Get her out there, buddy. Wait, no, wait. Whoa, buddy. Huh? Ooh. See, I don't know if I should set it. That's... Do it again. That's you. Huh. Someone call it, caught a whiting. 
just a little bit ago as we were first pulling up here. I gave up. There's just so much to do. Like what? That's not what I even meant to say. The guy just down there caught a sharp nose shark or something. I don't know what it was. I have my mom sent me the picture so you guys can look at it. I guess there's a lot of sharks in here, which is good to know because I'm going to go swim. Hopefully catch one with my hands or something. I'm going to switch to a minnow bait then maybe. Like yeah, that's what I was thinking, but I'm not sure when we're leaving, so I'm not going to start throwing I'll throw it tomorrow. Do you see what they're using for bait? You see what? He says, what you got, but put shrimp put on these it. on the end and the hook with it. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> I want to do that. I'll do it on these two. Yeah. He gave them to you? Yeah. yeah. He salted them so they're a little harder so they'll stay on the line. Is that what you do? Uh huh. And he said you have you to clean I did. I you did. Have, I love to, old guys. You have to clean them. <laughs> I know you do. Sharks right away. Yeah, but I don't think you keep them. No, we probably catch them at least. I mean, we maybe. Can, he says that you can only, the two small ones you can keep are the sharp nose and the bonnet head. You know the difference? Yeah, yeah he showed. He showed that the, the sharp head nose head has the has spots, and the bonnet is like a hammerhead only. It's a shovel upside down. Hey, pops. <laughs> Oh, Ellie, get him! Get him, Ellie! Come on, Ellie! No, 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 not in there! Come on! I gotta wake up at five or six or whatever in the morning. Where's he at? Oh! Wait! 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 Oh my God! Take it off the hook, or uh uh uh. Get water. It's brutal out here, folks. Wind's kind of cold. I can see it land. Yeah. It is our calmest day out here. Right now, it's just the boys, Charlie, Pops, and I. And it looks like it might be good. That looks scary out there. We might have Hurricane Katrina roll through, but you know, who knows? Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. Mine's like on the bank. Yeah. All right, here we go. Last uh, chance to catch a fish this trip right here today. This rod I got mullet. And this one I have a uh, shrimp and some fish bites. So hopefully we can get on some fish. I just had a fish, boys. I had a fish. Should I try it? It feels kind of heavy, but I don't know. Feel like a fish? It's just heavy. There's no like fighting back or nothing. Yep, yep, we're hooked up. Oh my god, let's go. Let's go. Oh, the shark. The shark. Oh, it's a hammerhead. Everybody's 
Wow. Huh? Don't let him bite you. Oh my gosh. A hammerhead. That's awesome. What the hell, man? Oh my gosh. No, that's a shovel head or a bonnet. Oh, you think so? Yeah. Right down here. Yeah. Can't hold it. Oh, that looks disgusting. Yeah. Uh, like that way, kind of. Oh, I, this is straight out in front. Bring it in. It's another shark. Yeah, it is. Here, just bring it up. Bring it up on shore. Yeah, I heard the chair. I was like, what was that? And I look over and this thing's just pulling. I just heard, I was like, what was that? And I look over, my chair's on the ground. So I was like, all right, it's wind. And I look at my rod, I'm in the sand and it's getting pulled. So I was like, holy crap. So I'm trying to get that untangled. And I start reeling it in. I'm trying to scream for someone because I know you and uh, you and Deb are next. Right. But I figured I'd let Santa Pants go first. Yeah. No, it, it my rod was on the ground. Oh, I'm gonna set this one out. Here's the shark catching machine. Oh my god. That guy's got a big one. Guy down there's got a big fish. Oh yeah? Really big fish. Where? Down there. Oh, he might be coming over here. Oh. Like, it's a big fish. Like, he's got a big rod and it's like all the way healed over and he's been fighting for like five minutes now. And it's pulling drag. Should I reel in? Coming this way? Kinda. Mom, it's the guy from yesterday. Your friend. I think. Let's go over there, Ma. I'm gonna do it just in case if he needs to come over here. Is it that your friend? Yeah. I love old guys. Uh, maybe. You might wanna. He's still coming down here. This is that big mama shark that you wanted, Ma. He caught it. That thing is freaking pulling. It's gotta be a decent fish. If he's been oh, fighting yeah. it for a bit. And I've seen that thing pull and drag. Oh, you see how he's doing it? Look. And he just backs up with it. This one appears to have a little more weight than the other thing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Have you caught anything? My kids reeled in two, like, 20 inch. Um, uh, nice. <laughs> we ate a bonnet last week. Delicious. Yeah, that's what you said. Yeah. So we saved that. Did good. you clean it right away? Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh yeah, thank you. I appreciate that too. <laughs> What's the best way to get to them? Or how did you get to them? Um, this one's got a little more weight, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah, they got two little ones, my kids. I filleted it, and then I uh, floured it a little bit. Okay. And then I put a little bit of Zatarans. Uh, oh yeah, the fish fry? Yeah. Just a little. And then I pan fried it. Okay. How long have we been I don't know. Okay. Forty maybe? I don't know. Okay. Just guessing. How many cats you got? 80. 80? Oh. Put your hand up there. Up here. Walk this way with them a little. Alright. Let me pass his rod. Now try backing up slowly up the beach. Alright. I'm not 
worried about breaking the line. I'm worried about being schooled. Yeah. You can, you can back up until you feel like things starting to, you know, take drag and then and walk down quickly and reel. Walk quickly, quickly down there and reel. Don't jerk it too hard because that makes you mad. All right. <laughs> No, this is my second shark. Well, I only caught one shark before, so it's that little bonnet. It's crazy. Yeah. So I try getting a few yards around. All right. Just, just try to do it as steady as you can. When the, when the jerk, when he feels that pull, just off and goes. And walk up this All right. Keep reeling if you can. Chase him a little bit. You gotta get some line back on that reel. Ooh. Keep going with him. All right. Next time, go ahead fast. He's going a little. He's still a long ways out there. How far out you think he is? At least 100 yards. At least. Alright, reel down fast. Walk fast. Oh. There you go. Well, you can hold it a little bit, but it'll burn your finger. Alright. Walk them back. Alright. Do that every time you, do. <laughs> you get down and spook him yeah. a little bit, he stops. And he tries to run. Keep reeling, real hard. This thing's huge. It'll be one to remember. Ooh. <laughs> he pulled me a little bit there. He was pulling me. <laughs> Alright. Work him. Alright. Believe it or not, you're gaining on him. Put your hand on the spool while you're backing up. Alright. Believe it or not, that reel can only put 25 pounds of coal on it. And that's 80 pounds wide, so. Wow. Did you? Oh. oh yeah. There's the fin. Ooh. Good job. I'm gonna walk in and grab that. Alright. Did you get a tracker? Oh my 
gosh. Is that a tracker ahead of it? Oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> How is this real? <laughs> this thing's huge. There now, you, uh, you get right there on the other side of them. We'll get some pictures. I just want to get them in the water. Okay. More. How much do you think you weighed? Too much. Yeah. Now, look at that rope. Let's see how this works. 